happened on three after reading this brand new swedish movie just dropped on netflix called let go and in this movie we see stella she is this mom she has two kids one is thin and one is little boy and this husband and uh, this movie start with we see the husband his name gustav in this movie he's really very this toy guy you know he really looks like a sad husband i guess but in this movie starts we see gustav basically ask her for divorce and when he asks her this and she goes basically like crazy in this movie we see she plans this last trip as a family to this uh <laughs> like the teenage daughter she wants to participate into this pole dance and they basically goes to this dance competition into this town and uh, after going to this i guess the town uh, we see in this movie this family basically come close together with each other especially the boy he has this issue you know he like he cannot eat any bread he he need to eat gluten free bread so he's allergic to gluten at first dad is like whoa it's not that a big deal but later on in this movie we find out it is big deal he's allergic and uh, and the teen daughter is just unbelievably annoying in this movie unfortunately she is so annoying uh and i i, I will say overall i thought this movie was quite good it's really very sad and uh, it, it's uh really heartbreaking end of it but still i did not like this teen her character is so beyond unknowing i was like wow she's so damn annoying in this movie while i did like all the character i did not like her like what the heck in this movie end of it like she's really happy because she found this boy like i was like what movie uh However, I really like all the performance in this movie. So the overall, this movie is really so sad and heartbreaking. Uh, especially, I really thought, like, when this movie started, I was like, whoa, I have seen this kind of movie before. But this movie, that toward the end, how it became, especially there is a twist end of it, it was so sad and heartbreaking. I really liked overall. I was like, wow. This is one of those emotional journey movie. You know, this movie, it is about Stella. You know, she's going through something in this movie. Throughout the movie, we see she is thinking something inside her. It's killing her, killing her. Uh, very well written, actually, Stella's character. You really feel for her. Although Gustav, the husband character, is not always clear. At first, I was not liking him. I was like, wow, this guy, he just jerk and everything. But toward the end, his character also made sense. Overall, this movie is one of those emotional movies. It's actually really sad. But at the same time, it made sense. Like, <laughs> And I'm really surprised. I was thinking I will not like this. But I end up really enjoying this movie. I'm really glad I checked it out. This is one of those sad movies. Like sad family movie. Uh, and I was like, wow. Uh, this movie really surprised me. How good the performance was especially the lead was really good like both of this lead they had really good chemistry with each other and uh, especially their struggle in their own life especially the husband and wife and you know? like in both of this actor their struggle in their personal life was really makes sense honestly so overall i thought this movie was very well like put together sad same time entertaining heartbreaking and heartwarming same time movie because this movie does ends with a happy note which i liked <laughs> it does end on a happy note how this family actually came together end of this movie i thought it was like quite good i'm still sad thinking about it but still overall i really liked this movie and that was my thought on this let me know in the comment what do you think about this movie is it too sad it is sad but still it's quite good sad if you enjoyed my this review watch other reviews on other movies if you enjoyed this please subscribe until i see you next time please take